y'all. It's your girl Antoine's rich aunt. And I don't know when the last time I've been in front of the camera, but I'm in front of the camera. And I'm in front of the camera because I want to talk about our patron. And I know I've discussed it before in probably a video like maybe a year ago or something to that effect. But I know I did not talk about the rewards. I talked about what I would be doing if you became a patron of the arts by supporting me, what I would be doing with the support if you were to pledge to my Patreon account. Um, but today I want to talk about the rewards because I think that that's important for people to see the incentives for why I would like for you to pledge. But first, let me give you a bit of history. Let me give you a history lesson. Like my little space. This is my creative space. You guys, this is where the magic happens most of the time. I saw my junk down there. And that is my cute little neat decorated table. Over there in that corner, all the way over there, is my niece's artwork. And this is where I illustrate. This is where I create some of my smaller paintings. And as you know from my early YouTube videos, all my larger pieces are done down in the basement. Um, but this is not that video. This is about Patreon. Now the reason why I would love for you guys to support me on Patreon and become and let's give you the history behind being a patron of the arts. Okay, so you can Google this. It's all on Wikipedia and stuff. It's real facts. But many, many moons ago, back during the Renaissance era or the medieval times, the aristocrats and the politicians and the church leaders, all the who's who's and what's what's of society, whether they be middle class or high class or whatever, supported the um, arts whether it was music, whether it was painting, sculpting, whatever, a lot of times these artists were starving artists, you know, that's where the term really came from. So they relied heavily on the um, um, I guess you could say an allowance, if you will, um, that was, you know, given to them to one, eat and have a roof over their head and to continue to do what they were commissioned to do. They were, excuse me, recording history essentially by creating um, artwork that was gonna be shown in the cathedrals on their ceilings and mausoleums and municipal centers and oil paintings that would be, you know, that are in famous museums to this day that tell a story and history. And the artists, whether you were a musician or composer, like, I mean, just some beautiful music that was that is still now, even today, inspiring people. So, um, here we are, me, little old Antoinette. No, I'm not Rembrandt or Monet or, you know, any of the greats like that, but I think I'm pretty dope within my own right. And I want to be able to continue to create content for you guys. And I want to be able to, whatever I create here in this studio, or well, sunroom, <laughs> I want to be able to give it to you. I want you to have it. I don't want it to just accumulate in bins or in folders or in my garage. I don't have all of this wall space to just keep hanging it for my own pleasure. I want you to be able to enjoy it in your homes for years to come and maybe be artwork that you hand down for years to come that will also create, um, grow and increase with value throughout the years so that when I am famous, you have some valuable artwork at your disposal. So anyway, our Patreon is a crowdfunding site for creatives who create content. Whether you're a blogger, whether you're a painter, a sculptor, a musician, an anime, a cartoon maker, or whatever the case may be. <laughs> I 
that's not my phone because I, I don't have a house phone. That's my grandmother's phone. But anyway, I just want to talk about the rewards you will get if you were to become a patron of the arts. Here on my art patron page, which is down, going to be, the link is going to be down in my description box. And it's also right on the homepage of therichant.com. You will go there. You will see a video that is on here somewhere, one of the way in the past, like a year ago or something. And you will see the video explaining what I usually do with the funds. Um, just a quick reminder, I usually buy art supplies. I use it to create content. I use it to upgrade, get better cameras, lighting, all that good stuff. I use it to um, teach classes so that I don't have to charge, but I might need a facility. If people physically want to be there, I have to rent the facilities um, and different things like that. Vending events where the booths are like $300 or something like that, that's usually what it boils down to. And to live off of, you know? Because essentially I want to transition out of being a cosmetologist for the last 22 years into just being an artist. That's it. Alright, so with the rewards, there's a $5 tier. $5 tier, you get my I'm dying love and affection. For you sacrificing your tall caramel macchiato or iced coffee or whatever you get from Starbucks or Dunkin Donut or wherever. If you don't eat out or drink coffee out, if you make it at home like I do and don't eat out like I do because you're an artist and you're on a budget, then um, maybe just that extra $5 that you might use to, I don't know, go on a movie or something. Once a month, set it aside and donate it to me. And in return, because I know that people like to receive something for giving something, you get... A sheet of downloads, digital downloads of ACEOs, which stand for Art Card Originals and Editions. Or they're called trading cards, but most people don't trade their art cards, especially not originals. They're not like baseball cards. People value these like, well, not that they don't value baseball cards, so let me not say that. I just know that I don't trade my original trading cards of art. I don't collect any other type of card. But you will get digital downloads of these. Once I get enough patrons, I will do a vote and the vote will decide whether you get an actual digital download or an actual original, because these are all originals. And you will accumulate a collection of beautiful collectible art cards that you can keep in a sleeve like this that goes into a really nice, beautiful notebook that you can use as coffee table art that makes great discussions. And I have several ones already made. So you'll get right now, until the vote happens, nine images that you can print off and cut and put into sleeves like this that you can get from your office supply store. Or you can leave it whole and just do the whole sleeve, the whole sheet sleeves. Here are several different examples of ones. Like I said, these are all originals, so except for a few prints. But so I will do a poll once I get more pledgers. And they can decide whether they want the actual card itself to be mailed to them or just the, the um, email downloads. Now for $10 a month, you will get that. Plus a four by six matted to a five by seven mat. So it'll fit any five by seven opening of a frame. <sighs> so here's the first example. Here's another one. They'll change every month. Some of them will actually be the portraits that I do. Some of them will be the abstracts. Some of them may even be landscapes. They'll change because they're prints, so I can always, you know, do different ones. Uh, for $25, you will get an 8x10 print, the 4x6 print, and the digital download. So now we're talking about for $25, you get the this, which is $25 in that big cartel store. 
and this, which is ten dollars in my big cocktail store, and the digital download. So that is a forty dollar value. Twenty five, ten, thirty five, forty. Yeah, forty dollar value right there. So moving up to the fifty dollar tier. Forty dollars, I'm sorry. Forty dollars. Original art. These are five and a half by eight original art drawings. You've even seen me create this one on YouTube. I just posted the video probably yesterday, depending on when I upload this. These are originals, guys. And I mean, I put some work into them. And they'll, you know, these are just a few that I've already started. I want to keep going. So, because eventually I'm hoping to have all a lot of patrons, okay? So you'll get that, the 8 by 10 the 4 by 6 that's matted, and digital downloads. Just one sheet. You'll get, you know, nine a month. One sheet of this, one original drawing a month, one four by six a month, one eight by ten a month, and there are different ones you can get, all kinds of different ones, all kinds. So that is for $40 a month. For $50 a month, you will get an eight by ten, but it'll be an original graphite drawing, one of a kind, out of my imagination, that I probably won't make a print because I just want you to feel real special. For giving me your $75, okay? So $75 for an eight by 10 drawing, plus you'll get the eight by 10 print, plus you'll get the four by six matted five by seven print, plus you'll get the five and a half by eight original drawing and the digital download. So you'll get two originals and two prints and a digital download. Now the $100 is an original drawing slash painting, whatever the situation is, it'll be original. And it'll be 11 by 14. Okay? This is what this looks like. Well, this is just a sample of what an 11 by 14 looks like. So show that next to an 8.5 by 11 paper that is has a 8 by 10 image on there. That's a pretty substantial work of art. That's what you'll get. Sometimes it'll be on mat board, depending, like this is a drawing, so this is mat board. Sometimes it'll be a painting, so it'll be on canvas. But I'm just showing you what canvas looks like, because these are not 11 by 14. But I may, depending on, you know, what you say, send you something like this. Yeah? Sometimes it'll be a face. An illustration I'll try to keep in mind who is the person that I, is my um, patron and I also um, will sometimes just do an, ab an abstract or a landscape you know these things I'll try to keep in mind but also you have some input as well so yeah almost like in commission piece almost 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 I say you have some input. <laughs> but either way, these are great rewards that you get. It's almost like you're getting an art subscription box, so to speak. I don't know if I'll be sending it in a box, though. It might be in a bubble wrapped envelope. I don't know. We'll see. But really dope rewards that you can enjoy for years to come. Um, maybe sometimes I'll throw in other extra surprises because I just love you guys so much. Um, so if you don't mind sacrificing that latte or whatever a month, we will be good. We will be good. And um, like I said, other surprises that I may throw in there, cool stuff. I'm really proud of what I, with, with the way things have been going with the coloring book. Um, so I just want to be able to focus on creating content for you guys. And this will help tremendously. 
all I want to do is just create art and get it out to you guys. So thank you for watching. Definitely check out the link in the description box to my Patreon. And it's also on the homepage, like I said before, of therichant.com. And as Evelyn of the internet would say, I'll see you on the internet. So